Shayna is having a baby. Of course, you know I'm going to be, to be the grandmother. Mother. The word auntie finna hate to see me come. Like seriously, y'all, how cute would this have been? Girl, I don't know. Look at how cute it is. Y'all ready? Team boy or team girl? I think it's a girl. It's a boy. It's a boy. Oh, no! I can finally say it on camera. This is so crazy, but Shayna is having a baby. <laughs> That's Auntie Baby. Listen, I am so excited, and this is going to be her gender reveal vlog. You guys have already seen me in this outfit before because I put a video up talking about I was going home to Augusta to celebrate Mother's Day, which we are going to celebrate the mommies, but the primary mommy that's being celebrated this weekend is Shayna. So the theme of the gender reveal is a little cutie is on the way. I know, I know, I know. Cute, right? Cute. So I wanted to move away from doing like the pink and the blue situation. It's typical, one dimensional. We bored, we tired. No shade to anybody else who has done it. Hell, I don't know what I'm gonna do when it's the time. So let me just hush and keep it moving. For a girl, it's gonna be orange. For a boy, it's gonna be green. And we're gonna have like lots of little cuties around, orange slices inside of the cupcake toothpick situation. Also going to do little baby bottles if I can find them with like the striped orange and white straws, a little something, something green on the side, a little eucalyptus in the vase. Just cute, cute. I found a lot of inspo over on Pinterest. So I'm going to be going back to that whenever it's time to start setting up the weather is trash it's trash here it's trash in augusta it's trash everywhere so we may have to move all of the festivities inside but that is okay that is okay that is okay we're gonna keep moving and then the reveal may be outside and yeah the list will go on so i have so many things that i need to pick up I don't know why I waited until today to do so, but we'll talk about that at another time because where are the days in the weeks going? Okay, let's not talk too much. Shamar and I are the gender keepers. So we're the only ones in the family who actually knows what Shayna is having. Now, Shayna and my mom, when I tell you, they've been a headache. <laughs> because number one, Shayna didn't want to have a gender reveal. She wants to know right now. Y'all know she's in tune. So she already feels like she knows what she's having. And here goes Cheryl. Child, I done had three babies. I know from the ultrasound what the baby is. I was up in there. I saw her getting up, moving around, and da 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 da. Girl, hush. Hush. You're ruining it for us. But, um,. Another thing, we're calling the baby, instead of like nugget and peanut, get up. And if you're from the islands, anywhere in the West Indies, you know what a get up is. So yeah, I was gonna call the baby my little oxtail, but get up is cute, get up is cute. And it's very fitting for the theme of the gender reveal. Like just, uh, I'm into it. We're gonna go all out for the baby shower, so I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to keep this small and simple, but if y'all know me, extra is my middle name, so I'm really not trying to do the most. So, Shamar's friend Leah, she's gonna be helping me with setup and just all of the things. And what else? I think that's it. I think that's it. So, yes, you guys are along for the ride. I'm so excited. Let's go ahead and hop into it. Y'all know I am filming simultaneously with another vlog. So, whenever anything is relevant to this one, I'll pick you guys up. Okay, we made it to Hobby Lobby. Now, here is a screenshot of everything that I have laid out to pick up. And I'm not really sure what i'm gonna be able to get out of here because it's not looking too promising they have a lot of fourth of july decor out as well as like the pinks and turquoise colors for the summer but let me walk around some more because i just got in here and we'll see what we can conjure up like see how cute and festive this is look at this y'all know i have a ton of these little leaves from when i hosted my line sisters at the house but we don't want to go too safari-ish when it comes to the green okay this section right here 
would be ideal if everything were more like this versus being in the lemon-esque type of feel but this plate right here is super cute like see how it has like the orange slices on there with the greenery this is what we're going for we can do without the lemons but that will be a good one too. All stems and florals are 40% off and how cute are these? Perfect. Like they have the greenery orange at the top and they're broken up a little bit with this cute little pale yellow color. I think I'm going to get like four or five of these just to be in the centerpiece of the table to kind of break up the oranges and all those orange slices that we're going to have laid out everywhere. Now, I know you may be asking, Shanice, what the hell type of flower them is? Girl, I don't know, but I mean, they look realistic and they're doing it for me being in the color scheme. So, <laughs> let's, let's see how this all comes together. Because having orange straws would be too much like right, huh? Ooh, all of this is so cute, especially if you're doing like a sweet as can be, what will the baby be, my little honey, little situation, super cute super cute and this right here is a table runner okay these would be so much cuter if they were oranges literally i ran over here thinking that it was an orange girl these is lemons change that color but anyway how cute are these little straws especially these little strawberry ones adorbs okay next up we have party city and five below y'all how cute are these I don't need them, but they're super cute. Phew. I forgot to turn y'all on, but we just dropped Deuce off at daycare. So we are dog free. For the weekend, I got home. This box was all of the decor that I already have. And those bags back there are from what I picked up at Hobby Lobby, as well as Party City. So yeah. We are finally about to be on the way to Augusta. I am starved though. I'm so hungry. Just text, I know it's a toss. Oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such a the Uber pulling up on call. Tell me as you trying to fall through. I'ma leave it up to you. What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you. Know we all for do what you're doing right now. Right now. Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking out loud. I know I want you. Long time since the last time. Got a tab, we could run up. Knew you from the way, now we grown up. My look, yeah, made the realest ones nervous. But if you want it, tap it. Hey you guys, good morning. So it's the next day. Once we touched down here in Augusta, I got straight into some prep work. I did two DIYs that I've been wanting to try for quite some time, inspired by Raven Elise. If you guys follow her over here or on Instagram, she's great for the cute little DIY hacks. So anywho, I made some cute little ice cubes using those flowers that I picked up yesterday in Hobby Lobby. I took a balloon, pried it open with a metal spoon or silver wear spoon girl whatever and then I took the stem off from the flower I put the flower inside of the balloon and then I filled it up with water a good little bit because I want them to be small but medium size because they're gonna go into like the little bucket that's gonna be holding the orange sodas Izzy's and all of that jazz and then I also took to making a cute little centerpiece one too that will either hold a bottle of champagne or 
I may do a floral arrangement in there just trying to see what I want to do because I do have some really skinny little champagne flukes that I'm gonna put alongside it with some orange juice so I'm feeling like that's gonna be the vibe but anywho I'm sitting outside of office max about to run in here and we're gonna go ahead and continue on with our prep it is currently 10 20 so hopefully I'm able to knock everything out before noon the festivities don't start until 6 so my idea is to be done right at four. Shamar's gonna go pick up some cupcakes and Leah's coming over to help me set up and Sim just got done prepping some burger patties. My dad seasoned the chicken last night. They're putting up a grill right now. It rained terribly overnight. So hopefully that's the last bit of rain that we're gonna get today. And God is on our side in terms of the weather. So yeah, let me stop rambling. Let me get in here because they just opened and the people are flooding. I know it's graduation time and whatnot. So hopefully this is not a hassle. And what'd you say the material was so I can um, put it in the subject or do I need a subject? You can just send it over to me. Alrighty, I just sent it. What's the first name? S-H-A-N-I-C-E. Last name? Springer. Thank you for calling Office Max and Evans. Can you hold one moment, please? All right. Did you want it 16 by 20, 18 by 24, or 24 by 36? So if you see this poster here, uh -huh. the whole poster itself, that's the 24 by 36. Okay, gotcha. And then the 18 by 24 is the one in the middle. And 16 by 20 is the one in the, on the bottom. 24 by 36. Hi, guys. Hi. They are my saving grace today. Oh, yes. <laughs> I was a little worried coming in here today because I was like, oh, they're probably going to be stuck over here. I got prices to do. I got all kinds of stuff. <laughs> yeah. That almost looks like it may be this size mm -hmm. right here. Okay, perfect. Yeah. All right, and just one? Yes. This is the material. The, the one there. So okay. it's, a, it's a thick paper. Yeah, that's perfect. Just take this right up front, and Mr. Bob will go ahead and get you checked out. Thank you. Would you like to donate it all to local schools for school supplies today? Um. Yeah. Sure. All right. And there we go. Thank you so much. Thank you. Whew. Out of office, Max, not Depot. Excuse me if I said Depot before, but. Y'all know what I have learned? Talking to people, asking them how their day is going, just empathizing with anything that they may have going on while they're at work really works. It be the key to getting things done because they see so many people in and out. People are very rude. Nobody just respects the people that are providing services for us because we're so consumed with what we need, what it is that we want. We got to get this done. And I just took some time out to have a conversation with that lady. So we're going to hope and pray that she's able to hold on to that promise. But in the meantime, in between time, I'm about to run to Michael's. I was checking online. They have something that I want in terms of like some greenery and stems. That's why I went ahead to use the flowers from Hobby Lobby last night for the ice cubes. And then I'm going to also go to Party City because I need some more balloons. Because I built the baby boxes and... I need to fill those with balloons because I only have one box filled. So, yes, I think, too, I'm going to stop by Starbucks and grab me a little. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because I'm out here running errands. And my mom, she was supposed to get up and cook breakfast this morning. Shayna and Ken had just pulled up to the house before I left. And Cheryl wasn't in the kitchen yet. We got my aunt and my uncle coming down. And um, some other family members that will be dropping in miss brandy's husband is actually making us some treats so i believe she's either going to drop those off early or i can go pick them up yeah so mm -hmm. i'm dumping on you guys but let me go because that only took me a cool maybe like 20 minutes in there hey i walked to the starbucks to can i get you started out with anything to eat Grande hot white mocha. Anything else? Let me um do an order of your egg bites as well. The roasted red pepper. That's it? Yes. I feel so funny driving Sims car these days. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Thank you so much. You too. These egg whites know they be good, but uh-oh. One done got bust open, ain't it? 
how cute is this these all are so cute but completely unnecessary because i don't need them see what's getting me is that these kind of look like a red orange but that's the problem they're red orange and they only have the pink and the black and white and then the gold so yeah the straws look like they're gonna be out for the count so i just stumbled on these really cute grass letters i tried to spell out the word baby not here but if i could get the word cutie we in the game letter can I make a Y out of? Because that's the only thing that I'm missing for the baby. I feel like I can do it with the, I don't know. Because I don't want to get it and I'm not able to use it. Like seriously y'all, how cute would this have been? My toxic trait is kicking in. Okay, so let me walk y'all through. I have everything that I need to successfully run this gender reveal, right? Logistic wise. Everything that I'm doing right now is extra pops of things because as a creative, your mind does not work when you need it to work. So I really wanna go all in with this little baby grass letter situation. So why not buy the styrofoam and the moss and just glue it on here myself that's what they did this is literally what this looks like that's it and that's all why not do it because these letters are girl hold still mm, 12.99 60% off they gotta come home with me they gotta come home that's it okay here's the moss you guys have seen me buy this before Oh, this is a sheet. I don't want a sheet. It's loose down there, but I don't need that big bag. Uh, here's another problem. This one ain't too bad. Mmm, that one look a little old. Okay, this moss. Does it really match these little letters? Kind of, right? But I don't want it to be too off to make it look like I made it. Ugh. Look, it's bad when you work here. Like, I'm I telling know, you, I it know, is I literally know. the worst. I'm the worst when it comes <sighs> to Michael because I'm always in here yes, buying I'm, and mm -hmm, hosting mm -hmm. and doing things. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is. It's terrible. But imagine if you were to get employed. You count on everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I would love that for me. No, uh -huh. I promise you won't because you're going to spend <laughs> half your paycheck here. Like if they literally just cut half my paycheck, like oh, it, it would, you'd be like, I whatever. would be like, you know what? It's fine. Buy whatever you want. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, you so much. Me. You too. Chow, they got unk on the grill. How does it feel to have your own grill at my parents' house? Like I'm part of the family. I'm screaming. <laughs> with this my dad would have been in here looking at me with two cross eyes <laughs> yeah <laughs> look no you can't complain yeah still life out things. of it yeah. um a lady yes. you haven't cleared the, the, the oh, spaces God. yet what is wrong with you oh god <laughs> Not cold. Mm. Hi. like she wants to take a break on us just mm -hmm. like that 
we do it next? Center, right? Center of the board. Mm -hmm. Or back of the board. Center? Yes. Right. If you move from there, you are now a hot lash. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm supposed to stand there. And don't move. Oh my goodness! Look at how cute it is. It came together. They eat Swiss way. <laughs> Child, I ain't even get to go and take no full video. Guests are already here. I'm just now getting done, getting myself together. So hopefully I'm able to, but if not, it's okay. You guys got the gist of it while we were setting up. Yeah, she was ready for this. Team boy or team girl? Team girl. Team girl? Wow. Okay. I'm the great grandma. She grand grand. Oh, wow. She grand grand. Yes. Grand grand. And just say what you think it's going to be. Okay. Ready? Yep. Why don't you take this guy? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm Granny. <laughs> Not Granny. Grand Grand. And what you think the baby is? I think it's a girl. A girl. Okay. Okay. No. You know, everybody know you. Did I tell you? No. I don't even know. I want for a boy. She's a teen girl. She already put your thing. I'm Tristia and I think the baby is a girl. This is great. Andy Pat. I think the number one is a boy. My name is Joanna and I think, think you're a girl. My name is Brandon and I think it's a boy. This agent and I think it's a boy. Oh, Dale, you are a great <laughs> Okay. Here he is. Here he is. <laughs> Mama is glowing. Yes, sir. Hi. Hi. Hello. Don't scream it. Why? Why you? Why you in the corner? Time. We had a lot of Team Boy. Yeah, I was about to say, Team Boy pretty deep in here right now. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Keep your eyes closed. Oh, boy, like <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 Shit, I'm peeping. Come on, suspense here. The kid don't know where to put his head. Somebody hold kid here. Okay. Hold on, wait. Okay. Oh, God. Okay, okay. Wait. Okay. Y'all ready? Yes. We hope so. Come on, team girl. Team girl. Ready? Go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you should take it when the um the 
I love you, Charles. I'm almost today thank you for allowing us to gather together and fellowship and have fun Lord we pray for the rest of Shana's uh, pregnancy that everything goes smoothly um, once again we just want to thank you for bringing us together amen, amen. amen. All right. and baby thank you you got to go to the church already yeah see ya Listen, the word unsee, finna hate to see me coming. Finna hate to see me coming. I am about to drag that auntie title into the ground. I am deep off in my auntie era, all up in my auntie bag, and I just cannot wait. I cannot wait to meet my little niece. Listen, you guys, this is your fair warning. Prepare to be sick of me. Hopefully Shayna let me share her all up on the channel because this is about to be an auntie and me channel. Mm -hmm. But Shayna has since made it very difficult for me because she had the nerve to pick up and move back home to Augusta. Um, now me and Cheryl got to go to court because we finna be in a custody battle trying to figure out who our baby finna be staying with. I'm just not understanding. I'm just not understanding why Shayna done did me like this, making it hard for me. But it's okay because I'm finna be up on that road back and forth about twice a month to see Auntie Bay. Okay, to see Auntie's baby, but nah, for real, let me stop playing. You guys, I am so glad to finally be sharing this amazing news with y'all. I already told you guys in last week's weekly vlog that Shayna was pregnant and a lot of you guys have already sent your congratulations and well wishes and we are so thankful and grateful for that. The gender reveal was about two months and some change ago. So right now we are in full fledged baby shower planning mode and Shayna's actually about to go into her nesting era moment of the thing pre-baby situation she about to start setting up the nursery and all of the things because <clears throat> let me double back this is about to be my twin number one she's a girl she's about to look just like me i already know it Shh, don't ask how mind your business number two she's gonna be a virgo <laughs> ever since the day that Shayna told me she was pregnant i did some math and if the math had served me correctly yeah she gonna have a little Virgo, I am so excited. I really wanted her to come on my birthday, but I'll do with the September Virgo. We're gonna let her cook. We're gonna let her cook. We're gonna let her cook. But God, if you're listening, <laughs> not me having a twin and, okay, a birthday twin. Like, just come on, bring it in the room. Come on and bring it in the room. But yes, you guys, we are just, wow, so overjoyed. And we can't believe Shayna's having a baby. Like, out of everybody, we predicted Shamar to be first, but this is crazy this is really something that took us all by surprise but we are so 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 excited like when i say the first baby in the immediate family y'all know how they go the first grandbaby the first niece and nephew they just get all of the loving and the spoiled just mm, mm, finna eat up we finna soak up in all of this and just bask in the moments so you guys will be along for everything else that is to share along this journey i'm going to be doing a lot of prep work for the shower it's actually going to be up here so a lot closer to me and it's going to be easy to go back and forth and do all the things what else somebody did ask for shayna's registry so i am going to drop that down below in the pinned comment it is not necessary or mandatory to do anything with that link if you so feel led to just bless my sister in any way we greatly 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 appreciate it but 
once again, it's just gonna be down there for you guys to take a look at and anybody that wants to support you have full range to do so. What else did I need to tell you guys about? Y'all had already seen a lot of the footage after we ate when we was getting lit at the table. So I didn't feel the need to reinsert that footage into today's vlog because I didn't wanna do the repetitive stuff. So we can sit with a little 30 minute vlog because they're coming back to back to back, honey. They're coming, they're on the way. What else? I think that's just about it. I thought I had something else to tell you guys. I was gonna put Shane and my mom on FaceTime so we could all sit down, recap and debrief about the footage from the day and Shane could just say her one too, but y'all will see her later. And I think that's it. I think that's all the updates that I had. Did I want to low-key tell y'all about something else? Like the decor, what we were doing? No, I feel like everything was self-explanatory and it came together well. It's just so fun to be around all of our family that we don't get to see often. So times like weddings and babies and just all of the blissful things just bring us together so that we can fellowship and celebrate as one. It's amazing. I literally cannot wait for the shower. But what else? I think that's it, you guys. I think that's it. If anything, y'all will catch me in next week's vlog. So without further ado, if you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Spam the comment section down below. Hit that red subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to tap the bell so you don't miss notifications every time I upload. I love you guys so much and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace guys. Baby.